Night, we're at the home of football, Wembley. I'm your match commentator, Derek Ray, at the microphone. And sitting alongside me is the former Arsenal, West Ham and Coventry midfield player, Stuart Robson. And with the league season about to begin, we have action coming up from the curtain raiser, the Community Shield. It is Manchester City versus Manchester United. Well, Derek, the Community Shield is always an interesting game just to see how these two teams are progressing. What might the coaches do differently? Are the players fit enough? And will they be challenging for silverware once again this year? And here's the Manchester City lineup. Ederson is the goalkeeper. Bernardo Silva plays alongside Rodri in the centre of midfield. And lining up through the middle in attack today, Erling Haaland. Well, warned by the referee, but not cautioned. Yeah, and I think he's got that absolutely right. You don't want to be throwing cards about left, right and centre. And here's the lineup for Manchester United. Well, it's great to see a team playing with wingers in a 4-3-3, but they've got to be effective, both with their dribbling and their crosses. Otherwise, they'll become bit part players. Well, just fractionally wide. Good strike. Walker, and it's Ruben Dias. Well, he's certainly not alone. And a good-looking ball, and not an attempt he'll be terribly proud of. Trying to open up the defence. Can he put it away? A really good chance for him, but he'd love to have that moment back, Stuart. Well, in those situations, you expect him to score or at least make the goalkeeper work. Kyle Walker could concede possession. <laughs> Sufyan Amrabat. They were playing fluent football, but then the foul, and now you would anticipate a yellow card. Well, he's gone into the book. Well, he was late, and he deserved a booking for that. Well, I think it's fair to say he doesn't agree with that decision. And crossed in the direction of the back post. Not too fussy in clearing his lines. This looks promising. Must take the lead here. And a goal! United forge ahead in the derby. And that has silenced the majority in here. Well, as the replay shows us, Fernandez picks out the pass to beat that defensive line. But you do have to ask questions of the keeper. Could he have done better here? I think so. You can't be beaten at your near post like that. <laughs> 
So City get things going again, and the onus is on them to erase the damage done by that concession. Well, this is looking promising. Rodri! Oh, that's a fine save. Put in by De Bruyne. Could still be dangerous. Rodri. This could be the equaliser. Goalkeeper getting in the way. Superb save. Pep must be wondering now, is it going to be one of those days for his team? Now the short corner routine. Magnificent challenge to win it back. Wasteful from City. Oh, breezing past him. Will he finish? Well, he gave us a go with power, but he might be having second thoughts about that now. Well, as you said, he's gone for power, but he's not even close in the end. The electronic board has been held in the air and we're going to have a minimum of four added minutes. Plenty of support here. Oh, great defending. And with that, the first half comes to an end here at Wembley Stadium. business the second half underway and City trying to plot a route back into this one Hoylund. the tackle completely mistimed and you would expect a booking under the circumstances and that is going to mean a caution the referee is absolutely right. He knew what he was doing there. Bruno Fernandes. Well, he has the measure of his man. Can he convert? And the keeper more than equal to it. And Manchester City will go to their bench. Who's going to get on the end of it? It might still be problematic. Emerson and goal made it look easy. But he's gone short with it. Deciding to go inside. Really sound defending. Well, a powerful effort, but he couldn't quite keep the shot down. And United will switch things around personnel-wise. Up, plenty of pressure. United might be able to cash in. Can he finish this? Oh, did so well to deny him.
Grealish. Grealish. No possibilities in the centre. He'll be delighted to have won the ball, having made that difficult challenge. United could get in behind the defence. Cross fired over. And it still could be dangerous. Can he finish? Vital intervention. Well, this is not ideal for him. He was booked earlier. A change in the offing for City. Well, not a free kick that's going to linger long in the memory, unfortunately. Yeah, and the less said about that free kick, the better, I think. Here's a change for Manchester United. Manuel Akanji. Not to like about that pass. Chasing this game, Manchester City, with time running out. And delivered by Bernardo Silva here. Oh, fantastic effort. He made great contact, but the keeper more than equal to it. Short corner favoured. Well, he read that brilliantly at the back. United being afforded too much space. Chance here. Unable to put the seal on victory. Well, what a chance, Derek. That was the game right there. Here it is now. A substitution. On the back of that particular challenge, will the referee let the matter rest there? Well deemed to have been a cautionable offence. Well, no question about it. He deserved his book in there. Bernardo Silva. Manchester City have work to do, but is it going to happen for them? This could be the equaliser, but no! When your goalkeeper comes up with a save like that late in the game, you have cause to be thankful. Well, that could be a key moment. They have to take those sort of chances. They won't get too many more, but let's credit the goalkeeper. Kevin De Bruyne with the corner. Not the most confident clearance. Danger averted for now. Take some progress with the ball at his feet. And a chance to whip it in here. In it goes! To increase their advantage. And will that be the goal that ends up securing it for them? Well, as you can see, his movement is really good, which then makes the finish look easy. That's a decent goal, that's for sure.
And full time, most satisfying a victory in the curtain raiser to the season. Well, it's certainly a good way to start the season. That's just what they wanted. They played really well today, and it's always great to pick winning trophies. First piece of silverware, and that is never to be sniffed at as the players applaud the fans who have been backing them today. Well, it's great preparation for the season, Derek, and this is always a nice moment going up to lift any trophy. Great for those fans as well. Now for the trophy lift. And with friends and family in attendance, you've always got to really savour these moments when they come around, Stuart. Well, they've got to enjoy this, Derek, and then get ready for a tough season ahead. They won't be celebrating too much tonight. Absolutely, Stuart. They all know the show must go on after this. For now, the players are allowed to be more carefree. It's party time. Yeah, there's a lot of hard work ahead, and the players know it. But at the moment, they're full of the joys of spring.